Okay, so I'm back and uh, welcome to part two. Hope you're sticking around. Um, before I do anything or say anything, um, I have to give a special shout out to uh, Frenchie and Ian, the organizers. Again, uh, I briefly touched on it, but the amount of work that they have to do, and I can't even begin to imagine it, to put all of this together, is just out of this world. And, and you have to remember, um, I don't know Frenchie that well, I'm sorry. Uh, I know Ian because uh, Ian's company, Maple Leaf Vapes, was the first online company I ever dealt with, and, and uh, Ian's been with me since the beginning. Um, I call I, I consider him very much a true a true friend and uh, a great guy. And uh, you know what? I'm sorry, Ian. I know how busy you were, but hopefully next year we'll sit down, we'll have a coffee, we'll shoot the breeze a bit, and and uh, you know I'd like to get to know you more. But having said that, um, on my behalf, uh, certainly thank you for all you guys do, uh, you and Frenchie. And um, I understand, folks, that uh, vaping newbies, uh, I'm sorry, uh, vape can wasn't finished yet. And uh, I was talking to one of the vendors about it, and they said they already started planning next year. So uh, just to put it into perspective, these guys really never stop, never stop. Um, there were two other guys that were important for me to meet, and they were probably the most in instrumental in, in my progression in the, in the vaping uh, community or vaping world, if you will. And um, I trust these two guys with my life. And only met them for the first time this past weekend uh, at Vape Can 2014. But I know if I need advice, uh, if I need a favor, I can turn to these guys. And they've never, never said no. They've never let me down. They've always given me true advice. I consider them both brothers. Um, yeah, I know I might be, you know, going over the top, but that's how I truly feel. So to hell with it. That's that. That is what it is, folks. I'm talking about Shay B from DashVapes.com and Wes McDonald from The Vape Shore. Yep, back again. Uh, the same done yet, folks. Stick around. Having some fun. Um, one thing I want to touch on is I always call the Vaping Newbies Facebook page a family. And uh, this really came to light this past weekend. Two of the Vaping Newbie family members, Jen and Brian, um, came by with their baby, one-year-old uh, Bryson, and... Uh, they, they couldn't get into the room, although they were told it wouldn't be a problem. When they got there, after a very long drive, they were told they couldn't get into the room. So they were sort of, like, very, very frustrated, didn't know what to do. They, they were sort of stuck there. And um, the Vaping Newbie family, and I felt really bad because I wasn't there, but the Vaping Newbie family stepped up. They took care of Bryce and Walla and allowed Jen and, and Brian to get into the main hall to, to see what we all were seeing. Uh, which, uh, again, was just something that was amazing. So I, I want to give a, a special thank you to three of the family members, and that is uh, Kelly, Phil, and Corey. Uh, but just to give you a little hint, that's the kind of family we are. If that's not family, folks, I don't know what it is. To me, it's the epitome of what a family is. So uh, nice job, Kelly. Um, I guess one of the biggest parts of Vape Can itself is that um, not only do you get to meet vendors, you get to meet people, you do a bit of networking, um, they have those contests, those clouds contests, uh, the, the O-ring contest, which uh, <laughs> I came in third, and I couldn't blow a freaking O-ring to save my life, my, my jaw kept locking, uh, but there were only three contestants, I ended up winning a, a Z-Max, so... Uh, that was a lot of fun. So there, there, there's the honesty, okay? I didn't really do anything but won a contest. And um, one of the, uh, a guy that I call Cloud King is, is, is somebody I consider my brother, Ken, Ken and uh, got into a K-Fun uh, contest with him and uh, K-Fun Cloud Contest and, and take a look. Wow, the silent movie era, you gotta love it. Ken, you know, I'm just kidding you, bro. You are the Cloud King. Uh, that was just a K-Fun contest, and, and uh, it was a lot of fun. I had a lot of laughs on that one, and uh, there were no prizes, so don't worry about it. So that's it. Vape Can 2014 is in the books, and uh, just a really, really good time. I met some amazing people there, um, as well as all the vendors and my vaping newbie family, uh, Phil Brusardo and his wife. Uh, 
the, the, the assistant and the, the friend that was there. I'm sorry, I, I didn't catch the name or I don't remember the name. And uh, just an all around great time. Breakfast, lunch, supper, just hanging out with the vaping newbies. I had to love it. Uh, on a personal note, before I let go, um, I just wanted to share with you all that uh, Phil, Wes, and Sadie Darius got together uh, with the Vaping Newbie family and uh, presented me with an authentic nemesis. And I'll tell you folks, um, other than an Oaken, I don't own anything authentic. I was heart, you know, really, really touched. And uh, it brought me to tears for the first time, in, 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 first and two times during the weekend. And uh, they were able, they managed to make Big Mouth McPhee speechless, even if it's just for a few minutes. And that's quite the endeavor. So uh, again, Ian, Frenchie, and the team, fantastic job. Uh, hope to see everybody out at Vape Can 2015. I hope to be there myself. Stay healthy, happy vaping. Take care, folks. to the end.